three turbines that are running right now. Two are, are set. We're supposed to have five. We got three that are running, making electricity, but two aren't making electricity. We don't have these running 100% yet. We're running, right now we're making about 270 kW. We should be making 375. We're not. If, if somebody doesn't try these things or somebody doesn't want to lead, then how are we ever going to have no landfill? How are you going to do that? You know, there's a lot of people, it's easy, I'm an easy target to pick on. Because I'm doing things. You don't ever have to, you'll never be controversial if you never do anything. All you got to do is sit on your fat ass on a couch and you'll never have anybody say a word about you. That's the truth. It's easy to pick on me. They say, well, yeah, he's collecting the stuff, but he's not using it. I'm going to show you we're using it. I'm going to show you we have the glass. Person. Yeah, we got the glass. How in the hell do you do it if you don't collect the glass? How in the hell do you do it if you don't collect the plastic? How in the hell do you do it if you don't collect the cardboard and the paper? It's easy to say that the guy's not doing anything. But that's total bullshit. <laughs> this is real. This isn't bullshit. No. Do I have these running? No. I don't. Failure. Webster says failure is if you don't succeed. Webster's an idiot. Failure is if you don't try. You can never be a failure unless you quit. I guarantee you, we're never quitting. We'll get these running. Is it going to be perfect? Nothing's perfect. There was one perfect person. They nailed his ass on a cross. So none of us are perfect. None of us. So, we make these pellets every day, and we're getting it down to a science. I mean, we're really getting it down to a science where it's working well. Second shift, we make pellets, and uh, it's cardboard and paper. And I just think we need to be smarter at using it, and, 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 and smarter using this. This is, this is fuel, man, this is BTUs. This is cardboard and paper. Look at how clean the bricks are in there. You know, I mean, you don't see any. And I promise you, if it was if it was summer out right now, you'd see nothing coming out of the stack. Zero. What you're seeing right now is water vapor. This burns as clean as a hungry hound's tooth. You ever seen a hungry hound? His teeth are clean. We've perfected a good fuel. We've perfected handling procedures. We now have a use for glass that would, we would have never been able to use the glass had we not had the ash. Had we not had the ash, we wouldn't have made the cement. If we hadn't made the cement, there'd be no way to take care of coal ash, and we would have never got into the coal business. So we couldn't take care of the ash. We've designed to run with no smokestack, but it hadn't been for this operation. We would have never thought about running with no smokestack. You will see this eventually run with no smokestack in your lifetime. None of this would have happened if it hadn't been for this project. You see, so so how do you how does one rate how does one rate what's good and what's bad? You know, I mean, it's easy to say that I'm a failure because I'm not making money at this. So I don't care what analyst you would look at, they'd say he's a failure. If you look at my books and you look at what's here, you'd say, he's nothing but a failure. But I see the future. I see running with no smokestack. I preach smokestack free by 2023. I preach landfill free. Somebody has to preach it, and then somebody has to do something. You just can't go out and be a preacher and not do something. I don't need to make a lot of money, but I need to break even. I need to be able to pay all of my debt, and I need to be able to pay my wages. I'm willing to invest in the future. I know what I'm doing is right. Somebody's got to do these things. It's easy to say, he's crazy. But you can't say I'm stupid. You might say I'm crazy. And I'll, I'll admit to that a little bit. Because I don't need to do this. My wife and I could have quit many times. You know, it doesn't take money and it doesn't take brains 
to do what I'm doing. It takes vision and it takes passion. I've got vision for the future. I've got the passion to make this work. Those are the two ingredients that America's missing. They're missing those ingredients. We don't even have them anymore. That's why we're not leading. I'm too little to be doing this. It should be some big multinational company doing this. This shouldn't be some little guy from Fairbanks, Alaska. I shouldn't have been the little guy doing the organic ranking cycle, the first one in the world to make power off 160 degree water. I shouldn't be the first one building a hydrogen kitchen. I shouldn't be the first one with a screw expander that is synchronous, running with no gearbox, direct drive. I shouldn't be the first one with an absorption chiller. Three pressure, first one in the world, still working. I shouldn't be, but I am. I am what I am, because I am.